exploring vision here with another video. Diesel and Tay. We're gonna be doing a video about me. Just kidding guys. We're gonna be doing a video about my RC cars today. And this one is just not gonna be the battery version. But this there's not any batteries in the car right now, but I'll show you guys my battery. That one right there. And we're gonna start off. Say hi, Lisa. Lisa. <laughs> All right. So first, we're gonna start off with the body. Got this one body, but I not really. It's old. It's really old. And this is my new body. Yeah, guys, my Mountain Wolves body. It's my hockey team. It's number 18, which is my hockey number. And everything else is like that. We're gonna put that. No, no, obviously it's all black inside, but this one's not all black inside. This one's white. And, um, see, this is my controller. Sorry about the bad footage, because I'm on my iPad right now, and I didn't have time to pull out my GoPro, so. So you turn it on by this little switch back there. And then, that, it turns on, the light. Alright, now we're going to show you guys my car what you guys all been waiting for and um here's my tires uh picket sc dirt track c2 and that's on both sides and but if you go here's my steering so servo that the track is stock waterproof 2075 dual no digit digital digital i always say dual for some reason when i think so here's my um, front tires, the Duratrack Punch SC. See, this is the back one, the picket, and that one's the punch. And they're the same on the side. So now we're gonna flip over to the motors. So, and then here we go to the um, servo. And um, we got the still tracks to stack one. My antenna won't stand properly. It fell off while I was driving it yesterday, and I can't find it, so I gotta get a new one of those. And there's our front. We're gonna be changing the shock caps and the oils in the shock, so it tenses it up a little bit. Here, I'll show you the shock caps and the oil. Here. Wait a second, let me find them. Sorry, guys. My dog got scared. Okay. Okay, so this is my um, factory team silicone shock fluid 30 watt, um, 350 cast, and 59 milliliter, two flow ounces. It's a Lucas Oil product, so we're going to put that away. And these are my shock caps that I haven't got a chance to put on since June 9th for my birthday. And... <laughs> Yeah, I haven't got a chance to put these on yet, and they're really cool. They're going to match my body, my new body that I have. And I'll show you guys where these go. These puppies go, each one of these, they go right there. See, right now I have plastic ones, those are stock. And those metal shot caps are way nicer, and they're not going to break because the slashes are known for the shot caps to break off. See, like, right here, see these little... Um, right things right there. Um, those I had pop off and me and my brother's car about six times. Now we're going to go on to the speed controller and the motor. So here's the speed controller. And turn it on. Turn this switch right here, but there's no battery in it, so we'll be good. And then here's the plug to plug into the battery. And there's the motor. And then it's a Castle Sidewinder 4, 3800 milliamps. Yeah. And there's, that's my steering servo. That's my like antenna box or something. Don't ask me what that is because I don't know what that is. Um, and my back shocks, my little thing. And my gears, I'm not going to be showing you those today. My, well, my gears in there, or you, may, you guys might be able to see them. My 
you guys can't see those. Okay. Well, I can. So, it's a 83 tooth um, spur gear and a 23 tooth pinion. The pinion is the small one that goes onto the motor right there. And the spur gear is the big one that goes right there. And that's the dust cover. So, don't, I'll go show you my brother's gear. He doesn't have a dust cover on his. Come on, Dean. Come Blakey through. Oh, he doesn't want to. Okay. Alright, so we're going to go to. Oh, hold on. We're going to. Hey, make sure to go check out my other channel, Airsoft Awesomeness, which I'm going to be start doing videos on it. So. Oh, never mind that. He has a dust cover on his now. Okay. Sorry, guys. That's disappointing. I thought he didn't have a dust cover on his. I'm just going to show them their gears. Hey, Colin, don't say anything if I mocked your video, because you mocked one of mine before. So, hold on. Thank you guys for watching Flum Video, and hope you enjoy this video. Please like, subscribe, and make sure to go check out my channel, Airsoft Awesomeness. We're going to be doing some stuff on that channel pretty soon. Thank you, guys. See ya.